Hi kitties. Little Volkswagen I've been working on there. A couple little customs. I'm just playing around here. Little uh, black wool special there for the old gasser. The old gasser. Uh, I don't know how much battery I'm going to have, so I'm just going to play around here. Just freestyle it. We're going to do a little freestyle it. Working with my little uh, turntable here. With Herbert J. Herbert J. with some uh, poverty caps. I'm not sure if I like that look or not. Of the uh, old Herbert J. Had to buy a nine pack to get that stupid car. And I'm probably going to get in trouble with the uh, music nannies, but that's all right. You know, the little old pile I've been working on. Little junkyard special. Junkyard special. Been picking up a few little goodies here and there. Walmart the other day picked up a handful of stuff. Didn't even realize that uh, I grabbed this little buddy here. Look at that. That is a treasure hunt. A regular, but a treasure hunt nonetheless. I've seen that before and I didn't pick it up. And uh, the only reason I noticed it was a treasure hunt because I ripped the package open and saw the writing. And uh, yeah, treasure hunt. But I like the car. I don't give a crap whether it's a treasure hunt or not. I like the blue windows on that. It's pretty dope. The blue coloring in the window. It's pretty gosh. And I finally found me a Jetsons Putt Putt Mobile. Pretty sweet. All right, little Jetsons. Everybody's seen the Jetsons except me. And I got a new little process I'm going to be developing, uh, showing you here in a while. It's a little custom I did. That car originally was a had graffiti on it or something. And um, so I blasted it, but it had them stupid orange windows. So uh, I'm actually making my own windows now. So it came out pretty decent. And uh, I'm going to do a little video and show you guys how to do that so you can make your own windows. You don't have to deal with a stupid uh, colored windows anymore. I hate that. Alright. And then yet another gas or variation I did here. The, um, he just knocked all the tampos off and left the, uh, the gasser there just kind of worn off so it looks like it's whatever you get the idea I love that casting though 55 shitty dude oh what else can I show you here picked up a whole bunch of crap uh, this is a, a little this is an oddball I have this is from what I've been able to research that particular truck only came out in that color one time and I thought that was dope I've never seen that before According to the uh, Texas or the what is it, the South Texas diecast, something or other. Them geniuses over there. They only show that one color. What else can I show you? What else can I show you? I've been picking up some uh, premieres. I got me this uh, Ferrari F40 Matchbox. Hey, what a dope. What a dope. And, uh, yeah, so, I love it. Anything else I can show you? What else I've been working on over here? There's a little one i, I got to finish some painting on. I did this for, uh, my buddy, uh, Azair Ruiz. A little, uh, sling, uh, what do they call that? Uh, uh, what is it, sting rod. And I uh, had to make a new little gun turret for the back of the uh, car there. It was all jacked up. I'm going to paint that yellow part black. And try my try a little uh, dry brushing uh, routine on that thing. So that looks... And I've been working on a uh, bone shaker that just fell apart. Great. Just great. Stand by here. Watch this while I fix the bone shaker. 
Kirby on its lid. Excellent. Another quality production from the Failmaster. Pooch me. All right. Well, this is it, this is in mock-up stage, so you you'll, you'll get the idea. You'll get the idea. Come on, Herbert. You'll get the idea. But check out the grill shell. I got rid of the skull. I'm not really into the skull. So, uh, there you have it. There you have it. And uh, what else can I show you? Anything else I can show you? Oh, I picked up this little track tee uh, the other day for a buck. Come on, get on there. I got that for a buck. Deep with a dupe. And as it turns out, I have two of those. Two of them. Now, I can't remember who sent me what, but um, in the goodie box that they sent, they sent me a couple of 62 Chevy truck bodies. So I've been playing around with the uh, bodies. So, uh, yeah. Kind of making like junkyard kind of pieces. So, yeah, there you have it. You get the doors and the hood and stuff and uh, kind of make them look old and rusty and dirty and had to make a firewall and a back uh, body panel and a floorboard with a transmission hump and a floor for the bed and you know all that basic crap basic crap all right is that it oh wait a minute wait a minute I got my buddy, uh, my buddy, Mr. Biggs, who came to visit me, he sent me some goodies. He sent me some goodies. Check this out. A K-Day exclusive. And another one. Mr. Biggs. I wonder when Mr. Biggs is going to get his chop shop up and running. I'm really getting nervous, not nervous, but anxious to see what he's going to come up with. I guess I'm getting nervous because thinking he's going to make better customs than me. <laughs> Dude, it's all good. And he got me one of these, another C10. I love that truck. I love that truck. Oops. And he got me another one of them. I love cutting these up for some crazy reason. And then like a day later... Uh, he sent me another package, and uh, I'm going to crack it open right now. Mr. Biggs, man, he's running kind of a tight ship over there at the uh, big shop shop. And what did he send me? What did he send me? Oh, it's all in, it's all secluded, wrapped, and everything. Oh, it's in an envelope, too. Holy moly. Come on, Mr. Biggs. I guess he didn't want his boss to see this one go out of the shop, but I finally got a skate punk. Finally. Finally got me the punk. Oh, the little dude comes off, huh? Sweet. Here you go. Little skate punk. I just wanted one of those just because I thought it was cool. Sometimes I'll pick up an oddball casting here and there, just because I think it's cool. I think they should make, I think uh, Mattel should make, uh, or somebody should make t-shirts like that. Blue with a Hot Wheels logo across it. That'd be pretty dope, because I'd buy one, or two, or eight. Be pretty sweet. Alright, man. I'm going to get my little uh, Star Wars warrior dude here to shoot at him or something to blast the skate punk off the skateboard there. I don't know. I'm talking foolishness now. So I will talk to you later because uh, I'm afraid I'm going to run out of battery. Uh, so I just did this little quick video. So uh, you're just going to have to stand by for the next one. Uh, I got... I got 
the third installment of the boy and his cuda coming up. Uh, I have to film it first. And um, I got lots of shouts, but I can't remember names. I don't write them down. I'm too cotton picking busy. So I will catch you po folks later. And uh, me the pooch man. Signing off.